If I'm not there for you, Mayu, it's plain to see how much danger you'll be in. Well, you're a little late, buddy. That's what I've been telling myself all this time, anyway. <laughs> but that's not the real reason I'm trying to. I'm trying so hard to find you. No, nothing so noble. Every time I saw your face and heard you greet me with that shig, bro, you'd always say, You were saving my life. Aww, please, Mayu, I need you. Please show yourself. Don't leave me all alone. Damn, just once more, I have to see the suffering of others. It's the only thing keeping me sane. And I am still sane. I am. God, I've taken so many of them. So many pictures of the dead. It's so weird. They're all real. Honest to goodness, corpses. But to me, they just look like fakes. Nothing but props. Realistic ones, granted. Much more detailed and lifelike than the cheap fake bodies you see on television and movies. <laughs> This one is the flashiest by far, utterly pulverized against the wall near the infirmary. Absolutely breathtaking. She's been reduced to nothing more than a chaotic jumble of flesh. But not long ago, all of it was connected. This was once a human being, walking and talking with a mind of her own. Should there truly be an afterlife? She must be embarrassed to show her face there with such hideous, defigured appearance. I'd probably feel bad for her if she weren't a complete stranger. <laughs> okay. What the fuck? What's going on? If I'm receiving a call, then why is the blasted thing still in photo view? There's no message telling me who's calling. Fuck it! Just answer the damn thing! Oh, that hurts my head! Thank you! Oh my god.
赤いワンピースの女の子か。Okay! Huh! Ahem! <笑> Girl in the red dress, huh? 私、見たかも、その子の例。I think I may have seen her, her ghost anyway. When I was with Seiko in one of the dark classrooms, she was crouched down on the ground and staring right at us. I saw her too in the shadows when Yuka and I were walking through the hall earlier. It's like she's keeping an eye on us. I was looking at the old newspaper in the We also found an old newspaper article in the nurse's office about Heavenly Host kidnapping a murder case. There were photos of the four victims, and she was one of them. There's no doubt in my mind that ghost girl we've both seen is definitely Sachiko. But in the article, in the article, So, but how is that possible? According to what we just saw, Sachiko wasn't killed. She survived. And if that's the case, shouldn't she have, shouldn't she have grown up into a proper adult by now? She'd have to look older than us at, at the very least. Staying behind in a place like this in child form with the other victims? Just doesn't make a whole lot of sense, does it? No, it doesn't make sense. Yeah, that part bothers me too. I'm guessing that shortly after the incident, through some unrelated accident or something. Sachiko lost her life as well. Sachiko's story, if you look at this report, it's not a good thing. I don't believe that is a very good idea, Satoshi. If we can somehow meet up with her spirit, maybe we can learn more about what happens. No, talking to ghosts in this place is not a good idea. I know the story of the past. More than what was reported at the very least. I don't know what to do, but I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. If it's the key to getting every key. Wait a minute! No, no, I was thinking back, Yuka. Did Yuka have, um... Uh, Kurosaki had the science key. But Kasami made a note of it, and he's like, well, you won't be needing it. And But I don't know if he took it or not. When I was playing as Yuka, was I supposed to run around and grab the science key and somehow use it to, like, get out? Somehow? I don't know. I'll take my chances with the school's curse or whatever the hell it is. If Yuka's dead, I'm going to start this whole thing over. Once we find Yuka, let's say we look for Sachiko as well. That is a horrible idea! Okay, okay, though, I am worried. I haven't heard Yuka's voice at all since you, before you found me. Yeah, we need to find some means of getting back to the other building. <gasps> oh, convenient! What the hell? This one feels completely different than any others. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, oh god, it's a big one! Hold tight. Nami, are you alright? Hang on, hang on! It's gonna be a bumpy ride! Don't let go! Nami! Oh, shit. That does she speak to me? You okay? Oh, God. Oh, God. Mean 
while. Shinozaki! Shinozaki, shikashiro! Shinozaki! Snap out of it! Slap her. <laughs> so what? Are you okay? <laughs> Clearly, she is perfectly fine. It's okay. It's okay. Everything's okay. You okay? Come on, Shinozaki. Everything's fine. You're safe. <laughs> what the? That's what happened to me. What was it like? What did you see? He saw the true identity of the... Uh, the murderer! That's why the damn doll wasn't enough. <laughs> Repentance from the killer. <laughs> we had the wrong person. Wait, are you telling me? You were actually there like you saw the scene of the murders? That's exactly what I'm saying. I was seeing everything through Yuki's eyes. I was bound and then I was killed. <laughs> hey, leave her alone. It's not her fault. I'm the one who wanted to know. The murderer was a little girl. You remember the newspaper article, Suzumoto? Is that Mayu? Suzumoto showed us. Her photo was in it along with her name. I hope we're not related. It's the girl in the red dress, Sachiko Shinazaki. She was listed as one of the victims, but believe me, she's no victim! Huh? <laughs> no, that can't be right. That's impossible for a little girl to do something like that. How could she abduct other children in her own age and keep them prisoner, no less? I could believe it if it were that monster with the hammer. He seems perfectly... He seems fully capable of kidnapping and tying up little kids any day of the week. He's just an accomplice. When these children were killed by Sachiko, the man was in the with the hammer was in the corner of the room, quaking in fear. You can't be serious. I have no idea why he would have helped Sachiko in the first place, though. We have to tell the others, Mochita and Miss Yui. 
Yeah, I guess. Even Nahu wasn't able to find the whole truth, and she's been in there longer than any of us. Well, she's dead. We don't hurry up and tell them they'll be dead before they ever find out, but Nahu's already dead. If Sachiko catches him unaware, it could all be over. We have to go back, Yuki, please. Take us back into the closed spaces. We'll find a way to exercise you and all the other spirits trapped in heavenly hosts, I swear. I wouldn't recommend that. As, as a result of your interference, as well as the interference of your friends. Those spaces are in a state of critical flux right now. If I were to take you back, even if I kept this clarity of mind the whole time, I doubt I'd ever be able to bring you home again. <gasps> but if we don't go back, everyone's going to die! Let's go, please, for our friends! Come on, for Machida! I can't, I'm not angry with him, like, I would be so conflicted, it's like, go back to that, like, go back to that place, save my friends, like, I'd be so torn, because it's like, I love my friends, and I would do anything for them, but if I was in this situation, it's like, would you realistically, like, uh, I don't know. I don't want to set one foot in that hellhole ever again. And you shouldn't either. We have to be out of our fucking minds to go back there. We die for sure. Why? Why do you have to be like that? Always have to be like that. That's what I hate about you. You don't give a shit about anyone's feelings but your own, and you're so stubborn once you set your mind on something. Are you honestly saying you're fine as long as you get through this alive? Oh, don't you dare psychoanalyze me! We'll die! I don't want to die! That's clear enough for you? Fine, do whatever the hell you want. It was stupid of me to even bother asking you. I'll go by myself. I can't believe you. Do you really not care about rescuing your friends? <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> You're a delinquent, a coward, a fucking pussy! Everyone's going to die and you don't even give a shit! Uh, he has a point there. You don't care about everyone either! The only person you care about is Satoshi! Yeah, he's got. You can drop the ad, it's gotten pretty fucking old. Always mochi da this and mochi da that! Well, I hope you two are happy together in eternal damnation. Before you go, at least try to read the fucking the writing on the fucking wall. Oh, I have no idea what you're talking about. Wow! 
I'm telling you, cause I love you, God damn it! Oh, oh yes, no, Claude, this stupid bitch. My wa, he so so that ta. You're so oblivious. Oh, oh. He it's the mo. I it's no good about any me that. What a no kibo. I want to give him a hug. God damn it. You've been watching Satoshi so closely, you never even notice how much I care about you. I mean, this has been a weird situation and all, but when we got separated from him and you and I wound up alone together. I have to admit, it made me kind of happy. I thought maybe it would be a good chance to catch your eye and draw it away from his. But all, the whole time all you could think about was him. You probably kept wishing it was Satoshi by your side instead of me. Well, Satoshi's not here. I am, so look at me, damn it! From the bottom of my heart, I. Oh my god. Just stop it, please. How could you think any of that is true? Well, the well, I do have to say though, in every single conversation that she has said, it's like we gotta save everybody. We gotta save Machida. Machida's not the only one I'm worried about. Remember just a few short hours ago when everyone was cleaning up after the cultural festival and complaining about it the whole time? Isn't that a precious memory to you? I w want us to have experiences like that again. There's still so much I want to share with all of you. That's why I'm going back, because if I don't, we can never be together again, and the thought of that absolutely mortifies me. So please, you can... So please, you can take me back. I don't care if I have to go it alone. Just please, hurry, before it's too late. You're certain? <laughs> yes. Oops, sorry. As you wish. Just... Oh no. Don't pull this bullshit. I loved you too. Just for the record, Kishinuma. I'm absolutely terrified of this, but I'm still doing this. Wow. God damn it. Do whatever the hell you want. I'm going home. Oh. Shinazaki Um okay then. Uh wow. Um <clears throat> Well, I guess I'll leave. We're collecting to buy a bouquet of flowers for our dear friend Suzume, who will be leaving us for a new school after the festival. 300 yen per person. They're, they're all gone now. <laughs> what does it even matter? It'll be just like my 10th grade year all over again. I can go back to being a lone wolf, no biggie. I'm pretty much used to it, honestly. 
What? Say what? Huh? Satoshi. What is that face? What kind of face is that? You've been skipping meals again or something? Oh. Kishinuma, you're late. But you seem in good spirits again today, at least. Suzumoto. Whoa. Um. You don't care about everyone either. The only person you You don't care about everyone either. The only person you care about is Satoshi. What are you doing? I the hell was I thinking? Why would I have said that to her? That wasn't it at all. It's not even remotely what I wanted to say. I just wanted to protect her. The fuck is wrong with me? I'll probably never see her again. I take it back. I take it all back. Please, God, let me take it back. It's a charm that I found on the internet. If we do it right, then all of us will be together forever. Or we'll always be friends, anyway. That's the gist of it. <laughs> Show yourself! Get out of here, ghost girl! Please! I'm begging you! How could I be such an asshole? I don't I don't want to lose him Shinazaki, Satoshi, Mizui, everybody Oh shit Sorry, but please take me to Mata I was about to run from us the way I always do. But when I first started hanging out with those losers, I felt like I was reborn. So please! Shinozaki is scared of everything, but even she's giving this her best shot. And I'm not about to let her upstage me. I swear we're gonna wrench that repentance from Sachiko with our bare hands if we have to and put all the rest of you at peace once and for all! <laughs> Sniffle. Oh boy. Oh, I, I can move. Yay. Just realize the colors change. Jesus! Holy fuck! What the? I got a text. But I have no service this whole time. Actually, I still have no service. Shinozaki, where are you? I'm here too. Let's meet up. How is he able to... Send me a ticket. Whatever. You should do it. You came after all. Let's see if he gets my reply. Message sent. Oh, wow. Okay. I'm worried about being all by yourself. <laughs> Jerk. Huh? <laughs> Starting to feel kind of overwhelmed. 
来てよ。うん、全。How do you feel a little better now? Kishinuma Kun no mail in Hengistano. Actually, that was probably the first time I ever responded to a text message from Kishinuma. But he's not coming, is he? What are you, what are you talking about? Maybe I should try texting him. What are you doing? Where are you? Phone probably just realized it's supposed to have no service here, that's all. But if but if he's in this school, I'm sure I'll run into him eventually. Well, okay.